Okay, so, hey everyone, Arctic Shadow here, and depending on where you're watching this, how you're watching this, technically, welcome back to Harvest Moon A Wonderful Life, a game that I have not recorded since October on YouTube. At least, I think that was the last time I recorded it. But anyways, well... Let's go ahead and get this started, at long last. Good old Marvelous Interactive. <laughs> you know, before the whole name change. Okay, now unfortunately, given how long it's been, I almost do not remember what I was doing. I know that we're still in year one. This is of course the original LP file right here, so... I have not touched it since... who knows when, like I said. So I guess for anyone who's new to, I guess what I consider the reboot of this series... Going from Let's Play format to stream format. Yeah, so main character is named Mark because memes. And farm is Funland Farm because save the homeland. Okay, let's see, what was I doing the last time I played this? Oh right, I guess I had saved. And so it looks like I've never understood why, but it's like the game. It's like when you say to sleep, it saves the game, right? But then sometimes it like it takes you back to the moment before you went to sleep, but. It, Technically, still counts as saving the game. Okay, let's have a look see around here. It's like, what was I doing almost five, six months ago? Oop. Uh, okay, nothing there, I guess. Okay, here we go. See, I don't need that. Water those plants. <laughs> Problem sense. Like... I don't remember what I was doing before. Well, I guess on the plus side, it's not as though I really had too much of a plan to go with anyway. But at the same time, it's like, well, I at least want to know, like, what was it I was... What was I really trying to do? There's our good old friend Takanova. Or Takakura. I know I told the story before in the older, well, the old videos, but I talk. Up oh, waterfall. No, the stream. Anyway, as I was saying, since this is a stream format now, one advantage I had with the Let's Play videos was... I'm hungry. No. <laughs> that I was able to cut out...
Okay, that was kind of weird. The stream kind of went crazy. Again. Well, my battle continues. Anyways, what I was saying was... I used to cut out like some of the stuff that I kind of figured that people maybe wouldn't want to see, like watering the crops or... Like right now, I'm just picking these flowers. Or like me traveling from here to there. You know, stuff that at least I figured no one would want to see like so many times over and over again. But given that this is a stream and I can't just edit it or whatever on the fly, yeah, unfortunately... That stuff is going to have to kind of stay and up. Oh, I already know what that is. So yeah, it looks like there won't really be any editing, there won't be any cutaway stuff. It's a familiar... Er, ah, Celia. <laughs> have my flower. bugging out again. Oh. Anyway, the stream looked like it was kind of bugging out again. And I just looked at this freeze frame of the stream and it looked like, well, Celia's eyes, they were like half closed. So anyways, I was like, take my flower. And she's like, really? I'm in your debt. And I'm like, it's just a flower. You don't have to be in my debt. Okay, so anyways, yeah, no editing of repetitive footage, no cutaway stuff. So for anyone who might have liked that in the original videos, well... Sorry, but yeah, that won't really be happening. Unless I were to, like, re-upload these videos later somewhere else. With the cutaway stuff. That's good, Vesta! Do you want this flower or not? And I still don't know why she says that you got something tasty. It's like, you're gonna eat this flower? Okay, ah, man, it's like, where am I even going? Well, one thing I did remember was I decided that I was going to go for Celia this time around because I love Celia. She's sweet, she's adorable, and I'm a sucker for her story. And here we have Mr. Asserting Assert My Dominance again, Carter. I wonder if he's gonna do anything in the dig site. Sometimes he does, sometimes he doesn't. I don't know, it's just when he does this, like even as younger, it would kind of like, why is he you know, freaks me out? I mean, I that he's whatever, and, like salute the sun and whatever, but so, it just, it's very close to the T pose, and it's like it's trying to assert. Laura. <laughs> So it's like you could feed him almost 
literal garbage, and he's like, yum, yum, I love this. <laughs> Well, actually, yes, I am, unless Harper decides he doesn't want to. Well, the better than it does from the outside. Okay, well, let's see, where is he going? Okay, he's actually going to the dig site. Ho ho ho! Ho ho ho! Okay, right away. Man, I made him sound like Santa. No, well. Okay, got something. Found something else. It's an old coin. Oh wow. That's three in a row. Well, I mean, I guess it still would be. I just had to dig more times for that one. It's like sometimes you have to do that with these squares. Sometimes. Other times, like this. Found something weird. Okay, I guess nothing there. And I guess now I'm just going to randomly go around and see, like, is there anything else I can maybe find? Oh, there we go. It's like sometimes you gotta do that. Okay, another old coin. Oh, well, it's like I'm on a roll. Found a fossil. Okay, I'm done. For now. Yes, there's something wrong. Okay, no, not really. The only thing wrong is there's not enough for me to do yet here. Keyword being yet. I have like 20 of those. Okay. Guess now that Let's see, I think I see Takakura, and then there's Muffy, I think. It's of no harm and <laughs> Oh hi Mark She's the only one hi Mark. It's 
It's like, yeah. Okay, yeah, well, unfortunately, since I'm not trying to go for Muffy, yeah, I'm not going to be giving her much anything. Let's see, Galen Merrick, have my flower. Oh, wait, he doesn't... That's right. Well... So he likes fish, right? Well, unfortunately, I don't have any. And... At least as I used to stress in the old YouTube series, you want him to like you. Unfortunately, it's like, it didn't even tone. In fact, I remember that his day for in town were like the third and the eighth. Well, I'll have to see later. But be the seventh, so it's like you're a day early. Well, for the most part, I think there's times when it's just random. He might just drop in whenever he wants to. It's like, go ahead and admire that coin, Ben. He's just staring at it, like, oh, what is this? And, okay, what was he doing there? Okay, I think that's everything I want to sell. Gustafa. Yeah. The guitar was nice. Will you take this now? I don't think he will. Also, give him another time. Or, now, what am I trying to say? Gustafa is also someone you want to try to befriend. Do you want this? I suppose so. I never thought of the sea as being like fireworks. Man, it's a good thing I'm not button mashing, otherwise it's like, it's automatically a no. Okay, apparently Casey wants to eat that too. Wally? Yeah. Maybe, I don't know. I guess you could consider it exercising. Oh, there's... Is that Lumina? Yes, it is. Oh, you didn't say it this time. Here, have this. No, it's not. Oh, there's Patrick. It's like, hey, I saw your twin brother, like, five minutes ago. 
Have my flower. Dr. Hardy, aka a guy who looks like he probably could have been a James Bond villain. Up, <laughs> oh, Mark is hungry again. And we will never know what's in there. Time for lunch! <laughs> oh man, that's a... Yeah, that's like, probably not the best lunch. Okay, time to see... Ramona? Romana? I can never remember how to say her name. Oh, Romana. And apparently, she... has to go now. Okay, let's see. Yes. Okay, finally. Well, I shouldn't even say finally exactly, because I don't know how long I've been trying to give her the flower. Sometimes she takes it, sometimes she's like, oh, I'll take it later, and it's like, but you always say that. Okay, and I guess Van is still here. Anybody here? I didn't even talk to him that time. Do you want this? Well... <laughs> he says that, but then it's like, well, if you like it then, why don't you take it? You can have it! Don't think like that, man. Okay, it's locked. Lumina, how did you get over there? Well, I mean, I'm... I mean, I know how, but it's like I wasn't expecting to see her there. In fact, I don't know if I've actually ever really seen her there much. Okay, Ruby. Take this. <laughs> I like you. Okay. It's like, and you definitely want Ruby to like you. See, when does Van stop selling again? Uh, Takakura, what are you doing? Uh... Oh, wait. Ah, the... I forgot. Cow. Where are you? There you are. Let me see you. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> so much for that. There, that way when you're hungry again. 
Now let me see you again. Okay, I named her Whitney. Okay. Jeez. Okay. Well then. <laughs> yeah, if your cow starts roaring at you like an angry bear, you definitely don't want to do anything. To make them angry. problem. The lights magically turn on. If only they could turn on, like, here or something. Because, at least for me, it's, like, nearly impossible to see exactly. And, oh, is he getting tired? I wouldn't know, since I can't even tell what's going on. Let's see, chicken coop. I only have you. Okay, just regular egg. Celia. That's nice. Okay, let's see. Was this the main house? Yes, it is. Hearts. I don't remember what I had her at before, though. Oh, and there she is. Okay, yes, he is tired. Well, I guess let me see. Before that, and for anyone new to my streams, I will unashamedly stop and look at a guide if I have it. Unfortunately, sometimes these guides take forever to load. Like right now, this one I'm looking at for Cilia. Well, ay ay ay. Technology, why do you not like me? Like, I spent forever trying to get the stream working as well. Okay, I don't think I've seen the two star event or the two heart event. What am I saying?
Okay, and supposedly, well... Okay, so I can't really do the, that event right now for the two star... or two heart. I'm thinking of something else, obviously. <laughs> two versions of this game, well, technically three, if you include the Another Wonderful Life game. Okay, let's see, I guess, I guess I'll just go ahead and sleep. So we have this... trying to say. We have this game I'm playing right now, A Wonderful Life, another Wonderful Life where you play as a girl character, and then another one, or, uh, A Wonderful Life Special Edition, which was exclusive to the PS2, which added some more things, which I think included, like, some different events as well. The god I was looking at mentions the two heart event and then a two three heart event. I don't think well I could be wrong here, but I mean I guess I can still try for that. Let's see, is this ready? Okay, it's a tomato. And it's not ready. Well, I guess soon enough. So anyways, I guess what I was trying to basically say is I don't know if what I'm reading about that 2-3 heart event is actually going to work. Because in fact, I can't say I really remember that. But like I said, I can always try. And at least the way to actually get it doesn't sound too difficult. Yes, move them all outside. Oh, there you are. Let me talk to you. Oh, oh, jeez. Ah, you're angry. Man, it's like, all I'm trying to do is show you my love. Okay, now you're nice to me. And now you're letting me milk you. Was that so hard?
fact, it's like, I don't think too much of anybody would be awake right now for me to do too much of anything. So to do what I want to do, I have to be at my house by 9 o'clock. Exit the house at like 9 o'clock. Well, I guess I can head on over here. A downside to this is basically the passage of time. It's like, it might be kind of slow in a sense, given how it's like one minute is one second. But it's like, on the downside is, considering how the character walks, if you're trying to make it to a certain event in time, it's like, will you be able to? Like now, it's like, I don't know if I'm cutting it a bit too close. Because it's like, yeah, if in real life, it takes you two minutes to get from one place to another, well, it's like it takes you two hours, and... Okay, our cow's a bit dirty. Okay, well, I'll have to... Can I... well, uh, it's like I'm so indecisive. Okay, I need you to... Okay, I guess. Nothing I can do there for now. Oh, I didn't even check. Okay, and here we have PSY pointing at a shiny curtain. Not sure if I've already gone through this. Just given how it's been so long and at the same time I've seen these so many times. going to be running in place. I was like, I don't know, maybe I could have tried to watch the cow, but... I mean, given how sometimes these conditions are, it's like... I don't know if I can really chance it or not. Okay... I guess now I'm just gonna wait. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's see. Did I do it? Nope. <laughs> you lie to me? Harvest Moon Wiki, whatever site you are. Let's see. 
hearts, exit your house from around 9 a.m. Well, that's what I did. Unless you mean, like... Well, I guess I've already messed it up enough, right? This is just me assuming that I haven't done this, which I don't think I have, and okay, I don't think I'm gonna get it. Um, what? Okay. Let's get you nice and clean. Oh, and there's Van again. There we go. Let's see, who's in here? I saw Vesta go in. Where were you? Oh well, here, have this. It's all mine. No. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna read your diary right in front of you. At least... I imagine that that's like her diary. Even though there's... nothing there. Well, it's either that or the bed is magically telling you stuff. Oh, it's Chris. And then there's Bali again. I don't remember if befriending him really... Like, if he gives you anything, if you're real good friends with him or not. Oh, I was almost button mashing again. And there's Murray. Not much is known about him, we just know that he simply is. Okay, there's... There's the little intro cutscene there. He says, come on, everybody. And yet, I'm the one buying anything from him. Oh, there we go. Sometimes it's hard to see those. Oh, I was about to say, where did he go? Oh, here. Take my flower. I mean, I'm not gonna question it, but... Yeah, I'm just wondering, like... 
Do those taste good? Is that why you investors seem to enjoy eating them? since he's hungry. Time to eat! And now there's three of them ready. Or almost ready. I wonder how many times am I going to be trying for this? Dog. Um, did you want this? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. I guess I'm going to give it to Lumina. I can't remember if doing that for Lumina also does anything. Well, if this was the special edition, you probably would. Since they actually bumped up her a ah, they actually bumped up her age to make her a bachelorette. But not in this game, so you don't have to worry about that. See Romana. Oh, hello. Don't mind me. You want this? Yeah, as you can see, sometimes she'll be like, oh, I'm sorry, I can't right now. And it's like, okay, well, so then when can you? And so now that I've already shown that to her, I can't try to give it to her again. So, you know, that's kind of the, the I guess, the struggle of trying to befriend Romana. There's Cody. I don't remember if you get anything out of befriending Cody either. Although if you do, I know for sure there's some way that plays into things later. But given that I can hopefully get to that part, I'll point it out. It's locked. Oh, is he tired? I don't really have anything for him today, so... So there's Galen... His wife, Nina... There's Muffy again. <laughs> oh, I didn't even... She's... She just talked to me. I was like, I didn't press anything. Yes, it has. Especially IRL. Of 
where I live, it's like we don't have spring. We just have summer and then hotter summer. Now, what am I doing here again? Um, I guess I can give you this. She's actually giving you tips about the soil there. Oh. Well. Okay, I guess... That's on me to... Well, I guess don't let me disturb you doing... That... Whatever that... Is that you're doing. Does Van leave at 6 o'clock? Oh, here's Daryl. Mr. Trespassing on Public Property. Or private property. He doesn't want that. I don't know, why did I think he wanted that? Oh, uh, he makes like this sound sometimes when he's happy. Oh, well, I'll take it with pleasure. seen Ruby. Well, I guess there's still a few characters I haven't seen. There's Flora. She says that, but then you try to give her flowers and she's like, oh, I have no idea what that is, so I can't appreciate that. Okay, now he's closing up shop. Oh, it's so hot. And now he's hungry. It's like, I just fed you, I don't know how long ago. Oh well. Let's see, what now? Oh, there's... Gustafa. Over there. Oh, no, wait. Ah. No, I don't want to... It's like, I don't want to give him any of my food. I need that. Yeah. Can I have it? <clears throat> and my voice. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that is Carter. Oh, dang, and it's already getting dark out. Oh, there's Nami. The other eligible bachelorette. Well, I guess for those who don't know, it's Celia, Muffy, and then Nami. And if you're playing the special edition, then Lumina. Oh, here's Ruby. Take my flower! I don't know why I have to ask her twice for that. I like you! Okay, well, the deed is done there. Um, let's see. D 
you want this? Okay, now he's gonna be... It's like, now I remember why I just button mash through this, because it's like... He kind of goes through the same thing over and over again. I love those! Okay, so he likes milk, and I think he also likes crops that you grow. Okay, that's Lumina. Man, though, it's so dark. Like, oh my god, who's that stranger? Okay, no, it's just Chris. I can really only tell, though, because I can kind of see the pink outfit. And now we have two... We have two blonde bombshells here. Take like Muppy. What the? Oh, I was about to say I have never seen her go into that tent before. And I mean, well, I don't know. Like, why would you go in there? Okay, time to try fishing. Oh great, Flora- oh, I was about to say, oh great, Flora's watching me. Okay, got something. We got us a live one. If I remember right, supposedly, like, near the waterfalls where you can get some of the best fish. That is if I'm remembering that right. Oh, Flora's coming back. Because in case you couldn't tell, I don't really have like the best patience with fishing in this game, at least. Well, I guess almost any other game. Although I guess Fire Emblem Three Houses, at least, is a little more forgiving, and maybe kind of sort of Final Fantasy Fifteen. Okay, Nami just like, uh, I just let's go back. Oh, hey, just a guy I wanted to see. Here's a fish. Ooh. 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 And I guess one thing to note is, you definitely want to try to befriend him as much as you can during the first year. Oh, okay, he practically just... Like he's ready to collapse, and he's hungry again. ahead and call it a night. Or, well, actually, wait a minute. I can't yet. Are you asleep? <laughs> like, yeah, that's probably a bad... a bad question to ask. Okay, 
I'll just hold on to that egg. I think I can maybe just go for another day or so. For this stream, anyway. Breakfast. And well, here's more breakfast. Oh, I I didn't mean to. Oh well. Okay, looks like that tomato's ripe. just the other two. Oh wait. I don't remember if I watered them a second time. Well then. Uh, I'm hoping that I planted something that will last through to the summer. That's usually how I try to play when I try playing, but given how I don't remember what I was trying to accomplish before, it's like it's hard to say what was my logic from six months ago or so. I can just put the milk. Three, I guess, and then if I run into Tim again. Oh man, Ooh. I haven't been checking the money. Oh wait, is it already? Oh, it's already day 9, I didn't even realize it. Yep, it's day 9, so... Next day will be the last day of spring. Okay... Cloudy... Fields... And more... Pointing at shiny curtains... I don't know, should I just try it for this again? I mean, I guess as long as I stick around the house as close to 9am as possible, then just try to... try to leave in time. Or... What'll happen if I try leaving before 9 a.m.? Oh, it's raining! Oh, jeez. Okay. I don't think anything's gonna happen now. Well, let's just see. And yeah, the bad thing is I left the cow out. Okay, I'm gonna assume that... It's not gonna happen. Because I do not want to have to deal with the sick cow. Um, let's see, I don't know if you ate. So, here you go. Man, 
that's a good thing I saw that in time. Well, at least I'd like to hope that I saw it in time. Okay, yeah, I guess it's not gonna happen. Oh, that's fine. I have a whole year to try for it, right? Well, I would prefer to have it not take that long. Oh. Well, it's locked. Oh, because everybody's out here. Oh! I guess for anyone wondering, if I remember right, Marlin does not like that stuff. So it's like, don't even try giving him any of these flowers. I mean, I guess so. Like, my fields aren't really much of anything right now. And she's just shoving me. breakfast, which I will not eat this time. Let's see, I think in other Harvest Moon games, if you stick around outside too long, you might get sick. Although I don't quite remember with this one. This game kind of breaks away from some of the usual Harvest Moon mechanics. Somewhat. I mean, obviously, it still follows the general theme of you inherited a farm and now you have to make money and make it look nice and whatever. But it's not like you have to deal with the Harvest Goddess or some kind of corporation trying to tear down the valley or whatever. I already forgot what Save the Homeland's main idea was there. Oi, Gustafa. Have my flower. Yeah. Let's see, I guess I'll head on to Romano's place. Ooh. It was only okay. You know, I'll, I just thought of something like... Where's his mouth? Like, I mean, it's like, given that he has kind of a long face. <laughs> and I'm pretty much just going to be ignoring... Nami and Muffy. Not to be mean, but yeah, because I don't want to mess up any kind of progress I've made with Celia and make her not like me anymore.
as she's here, like, I almost feel like she's threatening me, like, please make yourself at home, dear. Please make yourself at home, dear. And, of course. Oh, no, don't look at the chest of drawers there. I guess I'm leaving again. Grab some more breakfast. Well, I guess I don't have to worry about watering the crops today. Oh, and... I think the tomatoes are ready now. Oh yeah, they sure are. Okay, let's see, that was... Ah, that was a tomato. Oh, that's a strawberry. Are you also strawberries? No, oh, you're watermelon. Oh. Dude. I just separated. I separated them. Oh my god, poor dog. Other games, I think you could actually take him inside with you, but here he just jumps out your arms whenever you go inside. Okay, he went to the house, that's good. Oh, Nami and Gustav are hanging out together. Well, kind of. I don't know why. There's Lumina. There's Daryl. Daryl has pretty much become Wesker because I will give you an egg. Oh, he didn't make the sound again. I'm not even going to try to imitate the sound he makes, because I can't. Uh, here, have this. How'd you get in there? I can never get in there. And yeah, he's giving you some very helpful advice there about the cow. The cow that is in the farm right now supposedly gave birth. It was either 10 days or 30 days. Well, either di yeah, either way, eventually we're going to need to consider breeding the cow. And now you see it's like everyone's just walking around in the rain like nothing. Like what? Rain? Oh, nothing's going to stop us.
Oh my god, it's an animal! It's a lizard! With a bandage around its leg? Yeah, just that one bandage. Or it's either an overgrown lizard or a tiny crocodile. Let's see, I guess I already took all the flowers from here. Ironically, the, the forest sprites, or the harvest sprites say, like, don't take all the food and whatever, and then... I'm taking all the food, and I'm taking all the flowers. See, there's Flora again. I still feel like... It was a wasted opportunity not making her a bachelorette in this game, I don't know. At least, like, compared to Harvest Moon 64 and Harvest Moon Back to Nature, where you had five girls, here you only have three. So it's like, at least, they kind of tried to make it right when they made her a bachelorette in Harvest Moon DS. But from what I've heard, the game is nearly unplayable and not very fun, so... It's almost like... you realize too late! Uh, I guess... I... what? Oh. Murray just shoved me out of the way. Okay, we have Muffy and Burt Reynolds... and... Oh, well I guess I am kind of talking to her on the fly. Yeah, it's like, I'm not trying to make you like me! It's like, my heart belongs to Celia! Played by you. There is no way you will ever let me sway. Or, I will not be swayed by you. Yeah. And, okay, yeah, now he's gonna start talking about all that stuff again. Like, this is why I button mash sometimes, and it's a bad thing, because it starts you off on no. Uh-oh. I need food! Okay, no, I just wanted to say that. Is this it? Uh, yes, I do. Oh boy, here we go. I think this is the first time I've ever gotten this so early in the game. Thank you for making me the richest man in the valley! Well, I guess to be fair, I didn't know about this until like year two or so whenever I played, so now that I'm starting fresh from a new playthrough, it's like I can take whatever I learned over the years and actually put it into practice that much sooner. Goodbye. Farewell. Okay, I'm not Canal. <laughs> Demon Slayer reference for the English dub. It's like when Tanjiro has to leave and he's asking her all these questions, she's like, Goodbye. Farewell. Like, she really wants this conversation to end. Ok, 
Okay, I'm actually just going to save in case I mess this up. So, anyways, yeah, so I joked kind of how, like, thank you for making me the richest man in the valley, whatever. Well, here's what you want to do. Oh, no, no. Uh, wait. Can I actually? No, I can't. Okay, let's see. Did it work? Yes. So this is... Well, I don't know if you would call this the Ruby Spice Glitch. At least that's what I've heard some people call it as. So essentially, just... Rinse and repeat. Choose the ruby spice, and only cook the ruby spice, and you get another ruby spice. So you see, it's like now I'm up to four of them. And I can abuse this for as many times as I want to. So yeah, it's like, it doesn't really matter. You can say super salad. I just say salad since it's the first thing there. So yeah, just press salad. And then... Of course, choose the ingredients. And then press start. And then congratulations, you have cloned the Ruby Spice. And why am I cloning the Ruby Spice? Well, like I said, in the joke, you can sell the Ruby Spice. And it's actually worth a pretty good amount of money. So essentially... The idea here is, you can clone as many ruby spices as you could want, so long as you have the ruby spice, and you can sell it for as much as you would like to. Unfortunately, Van isn't here, so I can't show that off anymore. Oh, no, no, don't do that. I don't know what would happen if I were to try to cook two ruby spices, but I don't think anything really good will happen. And yeah, this would probably be if I was still making this as a pre-recorded Let's Play series, this would probably be the point where I would be cutting out this... Yeah, I don't know if people would really be interested in me, like, essentially kind of abusing a glitch 18 times in a row. And... I mean, I guess it's considered a glitch. Because, I mean, the Ruby Spice doesn't disappear. And it's like, I don't know, would it disappear? Especially considering, I mean, I'm supposedly making a salad with it. So then, wouldn't the ruby spice... Like, at the very least, wouldn't I just get a ruby spice? But then, basically just... Like, if I go in there with one ruby spice, would I just come back with one ruby spice still, since I didn't really do anything with it? If I remember right, the max amount of anything you can have in this game is 99. So... At least I would imagine... In your rutsack, you can hold 99 ruby spices.
Although the only thing I will say, if you do abuse this glitch, then essentially this game will become way too easy. You know, because the idea is you're doing the farm to raise animals and grow crops, so you can sell the crops, sell the eggs, the milk, whatever. And yeah, you're essentially just kind of making it into a joke now. Because it's like, what? I don't have to do any farming anymore. Not when I can just keep cloning the Ruby Spice over and over again. Okay, well... And so what I typically like to do... Oh, wait, no, not that. Yeah, so, I'm going to leave one, that way, if on accident, I end up selling all of them, I'm not SOL, so, yeah, I would rather just, I'm not out of luck there. Like, oh no, now I can't make any more ruby spices because I sold it. Uh, okay. Cal? Whitney, I mean. Yeah, I guess for those who don't quite get the joke, I named the cow after Whitney, the Goldenrod City Gym Leader. Oh wow, this is quite a bit. for the sheep. And yeah, I'd say that's good enough. Okay, and let's see. I think I'll go with the pond as well. Essentially, yeah, because like I'm good for it now. Okay, let's see. How appropriate I named the chicken Aerith. Okay, well. Oh. It's like, no, don't get hungry near the chickens. What if they meant 9 p.m.? Okay, no, I... No. No one's really doing anything at this time now. Okay, well... I guess that will about do it for this stream. Which would technically be the 8th episode of the original series. So, yeah, I guess thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time with whatever else I do. Later, folks.